so today I wanted to try something a little different. I wanted to introduce you to somebody who helps companies solve problems by connecting them to the university. And one good title, and this is Jennifer by the way. And Jennifer, so what do you do for companies in the Okanagan? Um, basically, it's to help them tap into university talent and expertise with connections and funding. And one of the good taglines you'd mentioned was? Um, basically, any challenge, any business challenge you have that you can't Google. So give us an example of a challenge that uh, a, a company in Kelowna perhaps has given you that you've used and that's how that would work out. Uh, some of the challenges that companies have brought to me, uh, a custom display uh, cabinet making company uh, asked if uh, how they might minimize condensation on a refrigerated display. Um, there's the software company that reached out to me that uh, basically asked me, well how do you in motivate users to put more information into our platform. Um, Two Hat Security uh, reached out to a graduate student who is in machine learning and they were they had a chat filter tool and their grand goal is to make the internet uh, safe for conversation and so they uh, work with human moderators for the most part but they brought in a machine learning expert to uh, help them identify things like misspelling so if somebody um, wrote the word ugly with a number one that would pick it up and then the human moderators could more effectively identify malicious behavior. So one of the reasons why I wanted to interview Jennifer is I had no idea about my text until I started digging a little bit more. So I just think for companies out there trying to solve problems that they don't even know how to solve, we have this whole university in town and perhaps there's a way for them to reach out to you. So how do people reach out and start that process and is it they have to cover the whole cost of the program or how does that work? It's actually a really co low cost, low risk way to um, potentially preview potential hires. So um, my tax shares the cost with the company 50-50. Well, that's kind of nice. So they get, you get to find university students to solve business problems while also covering half the cost. You must be a very popular person around with companies, I think. <laughs> I do love my job, yes. <laughs> so anything else that people should know about MyTex, if they've never heard about that, or what kind of problems people, like, do you have only certain categories of the university you have access to for that, or is it you can use any student from any department or grad student? How does that work? Uh, basically, any sector, any discipline. We work with everybody from not-for-profits to uh, small and medium enterprises to uh, large companies. We work across all disciplines from philosophers to engineers. I've worked with everybody. That's awesome. So truly guys, why I wanted to interview Jennifer today was there's problems in different companies that people don't know how to solve. We have this university uh, which is a great asset to community but I don't think people are tapping into it enough and I think if people knew that they can tap into it and have half the cost covered, I don't know, I think we create more jobs, which I think is kind of why I wanted to do the interview today. Because, I mean, do you notice there's a job creation part to it? Absolutely. Um, My Tax Accelerate has been, which is the research internship program, has been running since 2003. And My Tax has conducted longitudinal surveys to find out, well, where have, where did these uh, interns end up? Half of the students working in the private sector were hired on by their partner company. Um, and a really interesting statistic that came out of that was that a fifth of the these positions positions were completely newly created. So Two Hat Security is actually a perfect example of that uh, where they hired Ken Dwyer as their lead data scientist. This is not a position that existed in the company beforehand. Give her a call. It's just that simple. Okay. Thanks for watching guys.